News Channel 8's Chris Murphy is live along that roadway. And Chris, so how real does this look? You know, I got to tell you, when we were driving up the, here this morning in our news van, Russ, it looked pretty darn real. You can see the width of the lines is about normal. However, as you take a closer look and we got out on foot, you can see it's clearly a fake. Look how zigzaggy the line is, it kind of curves to the left. And what a mess as well. Look at all the footprints. Evidently, after the painting, you can see some people walk through it. So they do have quite a cleanup to do. That cleanup will begin at 730 this morning. We'll show you the video of the real traffic headache this thing caused. Authorities think someone painted it early Thursday morning while people in the area were asleep. Pedestrians, as you can see, used it all day yesterday. Now, traffic comes from six different directions right here at this intersection. Some applaud this effort and argue a real crosswalk is really needed here, but drivers we talk to say the lines are hard to see. When cars come to this intersection, they don't really know where they're going to expect to see someone coming from. This one here might be the worst and most dangerous crosswalk I've ever seen. Now, the Bureau of Transportation has studied this area where six different streets all to come together. And Amanda, they have determined that a crosswalk here is not needed. We'll send it back to you. Okay, thank you, Chris.